What's going on everybody? It's Cam here at All Things Automotive and today we have a 2017 Nissan Pathfinder SV. Um, about 85,000 miles on this one, clean Carfax and everything. You can see that all right here. We're going to just do a little walk around. SV gives you a lot of nice features on these cars. So, check it on the front there. You got your chrome trim there on the front, chrome grill, the black headlights in the back, a little bit of chrome around it. Big wheels in the front. The tires are pretty much brand new on this one. Actually, they got, might be new. Uh, brand new brakes and rotors in there, it looks like. This one does have the 360 cams, it looks like, so it's got the cam built into the bottom of the mirror right there. Chrome door handles and everything. Four wheel drive. Electronic assisted tailgate. It's cool. So that button actually there, put it down whenever you're ready. But it does have the third row seating in here. So. All these headrests actually just flip up. A little bit extra storage in the back. Not a whole lot of room, but you can always flip down the third row seating and make it a flat deck. So you can use the extra storage. In the back here, looks like we had a full rubber mat in the back. It's so good for if you have kids or anything like that. All weathered seats in this one. Electronic window controls in the back. On the left side, um, has all your electronic controls for your windows, locks, and mirrors. Uh, left side up here has your set, um, so you can actually set a seat for one or two, depending on who wants to drive. So you can actually hit set and then hit one, and it'll save the seat and steering wheel and everything like that to uh, whatever position you like whenever you get in the car. So, um, go ahead and lay everything up here. Just turn everything on the dashboard. So down here on the left, it does have a heated steering wheel, um, as well as it does have a traction control button right there. And then this is a tailgate button here to open up. Um, left side behind the steering wheel is your headlight controls. It does have an auto mode, so if you prefer to do that. Oh, I beams are on. Um, over here is your selector for your display, um, and then has all your controls here um, for your radio and your hands-free talking. Right side is your controls for your cruise control. Um, behind that is your controls for your wipers. Um, does have dual zone climbing up front, um, so you can adjust driver as well as passenger. Um, all your radio presets and everything are here. Does have touchscreen radio, I believe. Let's see if we can hit. All right, so that is the home screen. So you can actually just scroll through this, and it'll show you all the different displays. Actually, there's only two apparently. And then you can hit audio, and do your presets for your radio. Um, like I said, it does have Bluetooth, obviously, so you can do your, your hands-free talking. Um, but you can also use it for audio, and then it has their capabilities for um, XM radio as well. Also has AM, FM, things like that. Um, it does have a CD player slot, and then down here is your buttons for your six presets as well. Um, it does have all your radio controls on, on down below, your tuner on the right, volume on the left. Um, like I said, it does have dual zone climate, so you can adjust the temperatures down here. Um, all your AC controls are in the middle as well. Does have heated seats in the front, um, in the center console. So down there, it looks like there's a couple 12 volt plug-ins for uh, cell phone chargers. A couple orders in the middle. Um, then here's your four wheel drive selector. As you can see, it's in two wheel drive right now. So it does have a downhill assist on here as well. Um, whoops. Oh, power just went out. It's raining pretty hard. So um, center console here. It has a lid for both top and bottom, so you can show plenty extra. Sorry guys, I'll try to do this as best I can in the dark. Um, in here, you can see it does have uh, the factory books as well as a safety checklist sheet that we do. So let me go ahead and just do a final walk around quick um, so I can show you any minor flaws it may have, um, just to be clear. So it's kind of be hard to see in the dark but we'll do the best we can here it's black so i should show up on anything little, little mark right there Walk down the side i'm feeling it's good roof rack at the top rails look good don't think they've ever been used take a walk around the back tailgate and everything looks good it does have the sensors in the rear for backing up so that's good should have a backup cam as well See any door dings or anything like that down this side. 
Certainly looks good. But if you guys have any questions about this Pathfinder, please feel free to give us a call at 717-485-4224. Sales extension is 1502. Um, if you don't have time to give us a call, you can always look us up on the web at allthingsautomotive.com. I'm requesting information about this Pathfinder as well as any other vehicle we have on our lot directly to our website. So uh, thanks for watching, guys. I hope you have a wonderful day.